What's up guys, David here from Phone Buff, and the iPhone 6 and 6 Plus are finally here, this year with an all new design that's both bigger and thinner, which begs the question, how do these new iPhones stack up when being dropped? Well, that's exactly what we're going to find out today in this video, where we drop each of these phones, once on their back, once on its side, and then finally, once on its face to see just how durable Apple's latest devices are. Alright, so we're going to start off with the iPhone 6 on its back, note that we are using this platform here with bubble levels installed to help ensure more accurate and more consistent drops. So we're going to drop it in one, two, three. Alright, so you can see very minimal damage. I mean, really nothing at all. I mean, just a little scuff right here, maybe at the bottom. But other than that, it fared very, very well. So that's definitely a pass. All right, so same drop now for the iPhone 6 Plus. And one, two, three. Again, very, very minimal damage. Got some scuffs right over here at the top, but nothing that you would really notice. So overall, once again, it's a pass. All right, so those back drop tests are relatively easy. So let's take it to the next level and drop it on its side. So we're going to be using our platform once again to make sure we get the most accurate drop possible. One, two, three. Woo! So let's take a look at the damage. So we got a little scuff right over here. And then along the bottom, just a little bit of scratches. Nothing really too bad. No dents or anything like that. And uh, again, really, really good drop for the iPhone 6. Let's go ahead and move on to the 6 Plus. All right, so the iPhone 6 did relatively well for that side drop test. Let's go ahead and see how the 6 Plus does. We'll go ahead and line them up one more time. One, two, three. <laughs> 